From the red rocks of Sedona to the saguaros outside of Tucson, Arizona is absolutely filled with some picturesque scenery. And that's the focus of the October issue of Arizona Highways Magazine. Editor-in-Chief Robert Steve is here to share a preview of this with us. Thanks so much for being here. Thank you for having me back. It's always great to be here. This is the mecca of all things beautiful in the state. Yeah. Right here. And we make it easy. You don't have to hike or bike. You just sit in your car and take a drive. It's Stephanie type That's, of travel. We did this one just for you, Stephanie. <laughs> we're, de we're determined to get you out of the valley of the sun and it, into the wild and you country. Know, it's not that hard. When the weather starts to cool off automatically, I don't know why that is. Instead of saying here, we go, oh, but up north, they right. probably have something prettier than we have. Yeah, and it, you know, when we start heading into fall, it's not here yet, but as you do, I mean, there's there's the allure of the, the, the leaves on the trees changing color. Well, let's talk first with... Um, uh, Mescal Road. Yeah, Mescal Road is down by Tucson. Um, again, this the, 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 you have to kind of look at the weather forecast. Um, if you're in your car, it doesn't really matter if you've got air conditioning, but this road uh, actually would be a little more um, ideal, you know, maybe a few weeks from now or a month from now. Uh, beautiful scenic drive uh, goes into the mountains down there. This is what you're seeing is actually right at the beginning of the of the uh, drive. You don't actually ride the rails on this this <laughs> trip. But we actually love that photograph. Yeah. Don't um, make sure you take your four-wheel drive options. <laughs> there you go. You have to cross the tracks to take this drive. But um, uh, and then and it takes you back to actually a beautiful hiking trail if you're so inclined, which I know you're not. But no, but I other am. people it just can't might be. be. That's strenuous because <laughs> I'm frankly really out of shape. Yeah. Well, that's, <laughs> but this one gives you both options. But uh, but again, this issue is really about just hopping in the car and taking a drive. Well, people also uh, hop in the car and head to pay and quite frequently mm -hmm. once, once we start to see a little bit of action with the trees up there. Yeah, and right, yeah. Yeah, right now is a great time. Summer's great, fall is great. So uh, if you get the issue, um, heading up there, we've got a forest road uh, kind of just, just beyond Payson. Um, forest Road uh, 209, I believe it is. It, it's in the magazine. How um, do you find those? You know, we're fortunate to have a great staff and, and, you know, the magazine's been around for 87 years, so we have a pretty good, you know, sense of what's out there. But, but everything looks different depending on the time of year you go, too. Again, this drive, um, you know, might look different a month from now. So, um, beautiful drives and, and, and most of the drives in, the, in this issue are, are doable with a passenger car. Some of them require high clearance, but we don't put anything that requires four-wheel drive. So, if you've got an SUV, you're probably okay. All right, very good. Well, where else did you find that's kind of off the beaten path? Well, we've got drives around the state. I mean, there's some really beautiful drives up in the Flagstaff area, and, and not all these drives have fall leaves in them. It's not a fall drives issue, but... That's next month. That, yeah, there you go. And so uh, there's some beautiful drives up around Flagstaff. Uh, there's a road called Cherry Road up by Prescott. Um, but we, we as, as always, we try to cover the whole state. Well, what about Grand Wash Cliffs? What's that? That one is up in the northwest part of the state. And you're seeing, seeing a beautiful image there. That it's, it's called Pierce Ferry Road. And it goes from Kingman, Arizona up to uh, Lake Havasu. And it, it goes through this terrain that you're seeing here. Again, you'd think you'd need four-wheel drive to, to enter yeah, into that. I'm but thinking, where, do, where, like, where is that? It's, it's the northwestern part of the state. Most people, you know, you're making a beeline to Vegas if, if you know, they're going to, you know, head up there as, to catch up with Andy, I guess. But, um, <laughs> but anyway, it's a beautiful, very remote part of the state. And I, I really encourage people to, to visit that, that neck of the woods as well. And people always know about Flagstaff and Sedona, but there's a lot of uh, beauty in this state to, to be explored. When I was looking at some of the things that you were going to show us, mm -hmm. I, I came across this Galluro Mountains. Galluro Mountains, yeah. Galluro, is that mm -hmm. how you say it? Yep, that's down in... Uh, Lived here more than half my life. I've never heard of that. Yeah, that's uh, sort of a little bit north of Tucson and sort of east of Phoenix. And yeah, amazing, beautiful mountain range down there with, with high country. Look and at that. Yeah, that's a drive that, uh, yeah, who would think about that? Well, and I always wonder, and I know that I'm not the only one, and I'm, you're, you can set the record straight. I think I know the answer. <laughs> when you look at these pictures, you go, ah, photoshopped. No. There's no way they got that reflection. <laughs> There's no way. No. But, but your stuff is... is it, you go there, and they they know how to use the mm -hmm. the natural surroundings and the light yeah. and their camera and their expertise, and they capture things like this. Yeah, and, and patience is really one of the main main virtues with with photographers. They have to sit and wait till, as you mentioned, the wait till that light is exactly right. So they spend a lot of time sort of scouting and, and understanding where the light's going to hit, and then you know hopefully you catch Isn't that it amazing, catch that moment. The talent that you have in that magazine. We were very we're pretty fortunate. lucky. Yeah, we're it's an embarrassment of riches with uh, the photography in our magazine. We're very very fortunate. Absolutely. And, Let's hit one more place, and then I'll 
then I'll let you go. All right, then I'll go. <laughs> you could stay, have some uh, well, mega I'm going to wait for that food All over right, there. It smells you go good. To the you just got an invitation. How about, uh, is it Chevlon? Chevlon, uh, yeah, that's up in uh, the northern part of the state. Kind of comes from the Winslow area and, and comes down and uh, Chevlon Creek, um, which is really famous for a lot of uh, ancient uh, rock art. Uh, petroglyphs in, in some of that area. A lot of it's on private land, but there is some, some of it on, on public land as well. But um, and this, this drive, as you can see in, the, in this beautiful image, will we'll offer you a little taste of fall color as you uh, enjoy the drive uh, down on this one. You always, like, I, I, I'm with you for most of the time, and mm -hmm. then I, you always lose <laughs> me at the end only because I'm so intrigued by the pictures that I mm -hmm. have to look in here and find more. Yeah. And I mean, this, doesn't this just... Yeah. I mean, it, what we have in this magazine is absolutely stunning, and the, if people have not picked this up, they absolutely need to. T remind us of where we can pick, pick up a copy. The easiest place is, you know, they're on the newsstand, um, grocery stores, bookstores, um, Walgreens, places like that. You can also pick it up, order it online, get a subscription. It's a better deal if you order a subscription, uh, much, much more cost effective that way. But yeah, in addition, what you're seeing there, what you're showing, we, we have a beautiful for portfolio of, of fall leaves. So the scenic drives is the cover story, but inside there's also a great taste of fall color. This, I'm going to put it out. Well, I'm going to light a pumpkin spice candle and I'm just going to sit <laughs> in and peace eat, and quiet. No, no, no. I have two Eat some of those little Halloween <laughs> candies, those candy. I mean, there's, it's so varied so much, in our state. So much. Scenic drives, good news. Some of the best views in Arizona can be seen from a car window, and it's time to hit the road. It's time to hit the road and go pick up one of those Arizona Highways magazines. Well, we would appreciate it. We appreciate you being here. Thanks, Steph. You can stick around for the meatloaf. Uh, I may just do that. <laughs> when we come back, you're going to see Jeff's final presentation.